Hello there. Today we'll see Apache Camel interview questions. We'll go through some of the basic concept of Apache Camel. And if you are preparing for interview and if Apache Camel is one of the topic that may be asked in your interview, this is the video for you. So first question that you can expect is what is Apache Camel? Apache Camel is a rule based routing and mediation engine that provides a Java object based implementation of the enterprise integration pattern using an API or declarative Java domain specific language to configure routing and mediation rules. To better understand what is Apache Camel, let's first understand what are the enterprise application and enterprise integration patterns are. So you can see here, Apache Camel can integrate with multiple endpoints. It can have a JMS components or HTTP components or file components. So multiple components can be there and Apache Camel can process it there is a filter, there is a router involved in Apache Camel. So we need to define the routes, the filters. How to implement error handling using Apache Camel? Error handling in Apache Camel can roughly be separated into two parts or types, non-transactional and transactional. What is the messaging in Apache Camel? Message implementation implements the message pattern and represents an inbound or outbound message as part of the exchange. It contains the data being transferred using routes. It consists of the following fields, unique identifier, headers, body, and fault tag. What is an exchange in Apache Camel? Camel exchange represents an abstraction of, for an exchange of messages which involves a request, message and its corresponding reply, or an exception message. It consists of exchange ID, message exchange pattern, in-only message, in-out message, exceptions, and properties. How to read data from queues using Apache Camel? We make use of Apache Camel JMS components. We will be reading from one JMS queue and sending the message to another JMS queue. Also, we will be making use of active MQ queues. What are the components in Apache Camel? Components act as an endpoint factory using which we can interact with external system. Camel provides a large number of components using which we can interact with external systems. For example, here we have to transfer file from one folder to another for that also, uh, also we make use of the file component at both the ends of the message channel. What is camel context? We cannot run our camel application only using routes. We also need the camel context which acts as a runtime system for run that runs and manages the routes. It is responsible for all the mess messaging all aspect of a route. What is Quartz library? How to use it with Apache camel? Quartz is a richly featured featured open source jobs scheduling library that can be integrated within virtually any Java application from the smallest standalone application to the largest e-commerce system. How to implement exception handling in Apache Camel? Apache, uh, in Apache Camel, exception handling can be implemented using the try catch block or using on exception block. Enlist few good use case of Apache Camel. Apache Camel is a good choice when you want to integrate several applications with the different protocols and technologies. You can use it with Java, Scala, Groovy, or Spring XML. What is the processor in Apache Camel? Processor is Apache Camel is efficient is an interface that is used to implement consumers of message exchange or message translator. What are the components in Apache Camel? A component in Apache Camel is a factory or collection of endpoints instance. We can configure components instantly, explicitly, and add them to the Camel context in IOC container like Spring or, or Juice. Components can be auto-discovered using URIs. Apache Camel provides numerous pre-built components. Below, we have listed some important Camel components from the core module. Bean, Direct, File, Log, Sida, and Timer. What are routes in Apache Camel? Routes play a critical role in Apache Camel. The application flows in and out specified here. In Camel, we can define routing rules using a Java DSL. How to roll back transaction in Apache Camel D DSL? To roll back transaction in Apache Camel DSL, you can perform the following step. Remove Spring Transaction Manager, remove Spring Transaction Policy, and remove transacts transacted from Camel routes. What are IPS in Apache Camel? IPS Enterprise Integration Pattern is an architectural design pattern that defines code segment agnostic workflow for common business tasks. What is messaging? Messaging is a communication mechanism used for system interaction. In software development, messaging enables distributed communication that is loosely coupled. A messaging client can send messages to and receive messages from any other client. 
what is advanced message queuing protocol amqp amqp is an open standard application layer protocol for message oriented middleware amqp is a binary messaging protocol and semantic framework for microservice and enterprise messaging how to start the execution of routes space for apache camel to start the execution of root apache camel you can perform the following step create a camel context optionally configure components or endpoints add whatever routing rules you wish using dsl and route builder or using xml dsl start the camel context what are the dsl and which dsl have you have you used so root is in root in a variety of domain specific language dsl the most popular one are java dsl a java based dsl using the fluent builder style Spring XML is a XML based DSL in Spring XML files. What is ESP? Have you deployed Camel on an ESP? ESP stands for Enterprise Service Bus. It can be defined as a tool designated and de designed to help implement an application using SOA principles, not for all the project it is used. ESP as an optimal solution. It should be used when projects involve integrating a number of endpoints like web services, JMS, FTP, etc. So you can say if you have deployed JBoss Fuse ESP for Apache Camel deployment, you can see your experience. What is the difference between Apache Camel and Kafka? Apache Camel it is basically an open source framework. It basic basically or main, or mainly focused on making things easier. Also, they make the integration process very simple and short for the developers. Whereas Kafka is a very unique design messaging system. It is log service that is distributed and part and partitioned. Apache Camel is basically focused on the enterprise integration patterns. Also, it is really and highly configurable. Kafka it has a very high and reliable performance efficiency. Also, it is really scalable. What are the endpoints in Apache Camel? Camel supports the messaging endpoints pattern using the Endpoints. Endpoints are usually created by component, and endpoints are usually referred to in the DSL via the URIs. What are the various components in Apache Camel? Which one have you used? So Apache Camel provides us with a number of components. These components make inter interacting create endpoints with with which a system can interact with other external system. For example, using an active MQ components, we expose an active MQ endpoint for interacts interaction with external system. There are more than 100 components provided by Apache Camel. Some of them are FTP, JMX, Web Services, HTTP. Apache Camel also allows users to create custom components. How are exception handled in Apache Camel? Exception handled using the try catch block or on exception block or the error handle, uh, handler block. The error handler is used to handle any uncaught exception that gets thrown during the routing and processing of messages. Conversely, an one exception is used to handle specific exception type when they are thrown. What is the read delivery policy in Apache Camel? A read delivery policy defines rules when a, when Camel error handle performs an attempt, re-attempts. For example, you can set up the rules that state how many times to try read delivery and the delay in between attempts and so forth. What is route context? It is now possible to define routes outside Camel context, which which you do in a new route context tag. The routes define the route context and can be reused by multiple camel context. However, it is only the definition which is reused. At runtime, each camel context will create its own instance of route based on the definition. What is Apache Camel idempotent consumer pattern? In Apache Camel, we use the idempotent consumer pattern to filter or duplicate masses. Consider a scenario where you have to process files only once. If there are any duplicates, they should be skipped. Using the Apache Camel, we can use the item component consumer direct, directly within the component so it will skip files that are processed once. This feature is to be enabled by setting the item component equal true option. In order to achieve the Apache Camel keeps track of the consumed files using a message ID, which is stored in the repository called item component repository, Apache Camel provides the following types of item component repository. So thank you so much for watching today's video and if you think the videos are helpful do like the video and subscribe to the channel.